Hey, what's up guys? Your boy is Pilot 2K7 back with another GTA 5 LSPDFR video. Today we're gonna be playing the Coastal Callouts mod again by PNW Parks fan. It's an open beta, so it's not released yet. If you guys would like to check it out for yourself, definitely do so by checking out the links down below. Go ahead and click on the link that says parksmods.com slash donate and you can go ahead and get access to this mod before it is released. But anyway guys, welcome back. As you can see we are at Station Polito Bay. Uh, it's about 5.36 in the morning. Sun is coming up. We're going to go ahead and go on patrol. We're going to do a boat patrol today guys. We haven't done that in a while. We've been doing a lot of helicopter stuff. So I don't have anything really planned for today. We're just going to kind of go with the float and see what happens. In case you guys have never seen this station, I'll pretty much do give you guys a quick brief tour really quickly. So this has all been added in by a PNW Parks fan. So huge shout out to him. I just love this this Coast Guard station too. Very, very nice uh, station. So we have some motor lifeboats here. I don't think I want to take these out, mainly because they're bigger, they're not as maneuverable. I kind of want to take something a little bit more agile, but those are the motor lifeboats, which are pretty cool. And um, those are currently the largest boats we have. Oh, did that boat really just spawn? It just spawned. Alright, I'll run over here real quick. So out here we have the Fender boats. These are the smaller boats, 25 foot is there. So we actually have two colors which are pretty cool. We have the uh, gray tactical version and the standard orange version over there. So for today, I think I want to take out the response boat medium which is kind of in between both. Um, Attention all units, a reckless driver in uh, Palato Bay, respond code 3. So the response boat medium, I could have someone I just... Oh, there's one right there. The responsible medium is kind of like, uh, exactly what is medium? It's yeah, like a medium-sized boat in between the Defender size and the, um, oh, I was going the right way the first time, and the Motor Life boat. So let's head over there, guys. And again, guys, I thank you guys so, so much for tuning in. I really do hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, do me a favor. Go ahead and make sure you guys hit that like button and leave some comments down below. Let me know what you guys think of this. And um, here, so this is the boat we're going to be using today. I'm going to attempt to try to get a partner, but sometimes partners are kind of glitchy on this boat. Actually, I, I kind of want an oh, another boat, and I'm going to show you guys why in a second. Um, let's see if we can spawn another boat over here. Alright guys, so we got a new boat. The uh, reason why I wanted to spawn another one, I just wanted to have that machine gun out on front. You know, just, just in case anything goes down. So I'm going to attempt to get a partner. Um... Sometimes with the partners though, they act a little bit crazy, but I'm going to try. Let's see if we get a partner. Uh, we're going to give them the same uniform as us. And let's go ahead and spawn them. Alright, perfect. He spawned inside. Hey, partner, you ready? Alright, cool. So now we have a partner with us. Let's go ahead and get going, guys. Alright, so the sun is now up. I wanted to kind of get out before the sun fully rise, but it's about 8 o'clock now. The sun is up. We're going to go ahead and start our day and let's see what happens. So we're going to look out for anybody that is uh, doing any type of illegal boating today. Uh, obviously, we're available in case dispatch gives us anything. And um, yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens today. These people are just chilling out there. I want to make sure everybody out here in the waterway is well protected. There's another crew coming in, so as they come in, we go out. It's pretty cool there. Alright, so let's see what happens, guys. Let's see what dispatch has in store All for units, us. We have a possible burglary, a silent alarm trigger in Palato Bay, response code 2. Alright, sorry, dispatch can't do anything with that. Roger, dispatch, we are en route! I haven't really patrolled up here too much, so... Kinda curious to see what we get out here, uh, north of Toledo. I'm gonna try to go, like, north of the whole map and see what happens.
Alrighty, alright, let's go ahead and get out for a second. I finally. Oh! Oh shoot, hold up. Did this guy freaking hit our boat? Hold up, let me try rescue him. It's okay, sir, I'm gonna rescue you, okay? Oh! I'm gonna pull him on board. Alright, we got him. <laughs> Any available Coast Guard unit, we've got a civilian requiring assistance on a boat off the north coast. <laughs> Alright, we already got a civilian that needs some help as well. Let me go ahead and take him in. Are you okay, sir? What happened there, buddy? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and place you down, okay? You haven't been drinking or anything like that, right? Sorry about that. It's okay, I'm just happy you're okay. You have any injuries? Okay, you haven't been drinking, right? Excuse me? Okay, you have your boater's license on you? Let's go ahead and run his name since we have him here. Stop! Police! Alright. You little dick. LSP! Alright, sir, can you just give me your name, please, and your Get boater's up. license? Alright, Bo Darville. So let's go ahead and run his name. Bo Darville. Now the cool thing about coming out here and doing the boat stuff, you could kind of just, whatever happens, happens. Because, like, this obviously was not planned, so that was pretty cool. Let's uh, run his name through... Ooh, records check here with Patrol Toolkit. I want to see if he has a boating license for that jet ski there. And he does have a license. All right, perfect. So he has a license. He's valid to 2021. So that's awesome there. All right, um, you wasn't drinking or anything like that, right, sir? Let's go ahead and perform a breathalyzer test on him. Where did his jet ski go, by the way? I should have anchored us. Alright, no alcohol. Alright, perfect. Would you like a ride to shore, sir? So we can give him a ride to shore. Citizens report a 415 in Palato Bay. Respond code 2. I'm trying to see. I think we lost his uh, jet ski. I should have tied it to our boat so we don't lose it. Um, let's see if we can take this guy to the shore. Um, William 2, copy that. We're in the vicinity. We'll probably charge him with, like, using this un, like, in an unsafe way or whatever. So, um, yeah, you could go ahead and... Oh, I gotta show my warning. Alright, off you go! Alright, so what we'll do, you go ahead and take a seat, okay? Let's put him in here somewhere. Oh, okay, he's gonna sit downstairs. I forgot about down there. So that's where we put people that we rescue. Um, I, I'm thinking, I think we're going to probably charge him because he was operating his jet ski in an unsafe way there. Um, yeah, his jet ski is completely gone. So let's take him back to the shore. We'll drop him off and then we'll continue our patrol. So I did want to respond to that other call, the boat in distress. But unfortunately, I knew that it would take us too long to do with this guy. So... Uh, another unit was able to take that call, and then we'll um, we'll uh, get the next one. All right, so we're gonna drop them off on shore right over here. Oh shit! I didn't realize it was so shallow here. All right, let's just go ahead and anchor ourselves up real quick. All right, I'm gonna try to take this guy out. I only want to take him out, but I'm probably going to have to take out my partner, too. Um, I don't think I could take out just him. Alright, we'll just take everybody out. So, release passengers. Oh, perfect. Citizens only report an assault on a civilian in Palato Bay. Units respond code 3. Alright, perfect. So, my partner's still inside, so that's good. So, let me just make sure this guy gets on land, because I, I would hate for him to drown or something, you know? I want to just leave him here. Roger, we're heading over now. Oh, plus we got to give him those citations, too. So we're going to ticket him for um, driving unsafely there. Oh, you know what I should have did? I should have carried him like that. <laughs> it's so funny carrying people like this. This is... <laughs> It's so hilarious. I'm gonna stand in front of this ship. This may be a good thumbnail. We'll, we'll see. Oh, it's so funny carrying people like this. <laughs> Alright, let's play some down. Alright, uh, here's the deal. Police! I'm gonna have to give you a citation because of your reckless actions back there, okay? Okay. So make sure you be a little bit safer there in the future, alright? 
Yeah, unfortunately you lost your jet ski there too. It, that thing sunk like a rock, man. Alright, you go ahead and get out of here, alright? Stay safe, sir. Alright, so we're good to go. Let's get back on board. Let's uh, get ready to man this machine gun also, just in case we get into anything crazy. want to make sure we're prepared. So we're going to go with the... Is this the one? Combat? No, this one. Alright, cool. It's like a smaller version of that gun. So if anything happens, we come up here and we go ahead and man this gun here. Alright, let's go ahead and get going, guys. Let's see what else happens today. And, um, so far, so good. So far, so good. I really thought that guy was going to be drunk, though. Because he was kind of like... I don't know, he just seems like he was out of it. But it's probably because we were... Like, the boat was rocking and everything like that. Oh, shoot. Are those dolphins or sharks? We should probably do something for, like, Shark Week or something. It probably passed already, but... That would have probably been something cool to do in GTA. That guy was an idiot, huh, partner? He, he drove right past us and then came back and hit us, man. near Humane Labs and Research. We have suspicious offshore activity near the Humane Labs facility. All units respond code 99. Hey, we got a suspicious vehicle. Let's go ahead and respond to that. That's all the way near the Humane Labs uh, area. They didn't say what was suspicious about it, but we got to get over there and check it out. Let's turn our lights on. Alright, so there should be no boat traffic in that area or in the beach near that area. So, the Humane Laboratory is a restricted area. There should be no boats there. So, currently there's a boat just hanging out and loitering over there. So, let's go ahead and get over there, check it out, and see what's going on. There's going to be a pretty decent journey here. We kind of have to wrap around the whole top portion of the map. So, it's going to hold down the throttle there. Oh, I didn't know this was there. Our speed thing there. That's pretty cool. So we're holding about 70 knots. That's pretty cool, man. Alright, so we have a little ways to go, guys. Sit back, relax, and uh, we'll pick this up when we get there. Alright, guys, so we made it around the north portion of the map there. Uh, we're coming up on the Humane Labs. Uh, laboratory right up ahead and let's see what we find here so again they didn't let us know what type of vessel it is I'm guessing it's probably gonna be this one right here all right let's see if we can see what they're doing here yep this is um I don't see what they're doing though is he fishing yep he's uh doing a little bit of illegal fishing there this is not the area you want to fish, especially next to a lavatory. Who knows what type of chemicals could spill out into the ocean here. And we'll go ahead and initiate a stop here with them. Alright, they're not running. Alright, perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready to board their ship. Our partner is going to go ahead and just watch our back there. Anchor my boat. Attention oh, no, 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 no. I always do that. We are code four. No, I always do that. Dang it. I press A on my controller to um to select anchor my boat and by doing that I um 
cancel the traffic stop. I always forget that, so I'm gonna try to initiate on him again. Is this thing in the same boat? It looks like they lost the person. Oh well. I completely forgot about that. So let's make sure we don't do that again. Well, let's use the keyboard. So we're gonna anchor my boat. Oh, let's get closer. Anchor my boat, and their boat is going to be attached to ours. All right, so let's go ahead and make uh, contact with the person here. Hello, sir. United States Coast Guard. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and board your vessel, okay? All right, so we're going to go ahead and board. All right, we're on board. All right, sir. Uh, what are you doing out here? So, oh, sorry, officer, did I do something wrong? How should I make it better? <laughs> Suggestive wink. Uh, no, I don't want you to make it better like that, okay, sir? So, uh, reason why I'm stopping you, you're actually in a restricted area, and that boat is over there as well. Um, this is a restricted area. This is Humane Lavatory. Um, if you follow the signs, you would know you should not be here. Okay. You do have a boating license, right? Let's make sure he has a boating license. Get bump. Alright, dialing Keiki, so we're gonna go ahead and run his uh, name really quickly. I just wanna confirm he does have the proper license here. And he does not have a boating license, guys. He does not. Alright, by any chance, uh, do you have a boating license? I mean, this you gave me a driver's license here, but do you have a boating license by chance? Okay, yeah, because this is your driver's license. You do need a boating license here, okay? Uh, you have life jackets on board for you and all your passengers? Let's see if he has life jackets. He's not showing me. He's not wearing them. You have a fire extinguisher, sir? Okay, he does have fire extinguishers. you have any distress signals such as flares? Okay, he does have flares. So at least, at least he has all of the proper things he's supposed to have. You haven't been drinking or anything like that, right? No one answer. Uh, is that a yes then? Alright, here, do me a favor. Go ahead and uh, get out of the vehicle for me, okay? Alright. You have anything illegal on you, my man? Let's go ahead and pat him down really quickly. Alright, so here's the deal. No, don't freaking leave. He was just about to jump. I caught him. Oh, and I made myself jump because I'm trying to search him, I think. What is my guy doing? I think I'm searching him. All right, Citizens nothing illegal report. on him. A group of suspicious persons loitering, possible camper in Sandy Shores. All right, so we're gonna give him some citations for boating illegally here. Um, let's search his boat really quickly. I already placed him inside of my boat. Roger, we're heading over now. So he's boating without a license. Brown bag stuff with money. That's a little suspicious there. All right, so we're gonna tow this boat here. Oh, I forgot. Let me do a breathalyzer test on him. All right, uh, Dylan, you didn't want to answer my questions. So I'm a little bit concerned to see if you've been drinking. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this breathalyzer on you, okay? Hopefully I do him and not my partner. Oh, he's boating a lick. So that's why he didn't want to answer, guys. He is over the limit. He's double the limit. Nearly triple the limit, guys. Alright. So we're going to do... Let's go ahead and tow his boat. Now there's just a whole bunch of boats out here. That shouldn't be out here. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and tow his boat. Alright, so we got his boat towed, and we're going to take him back to Polito Bay Station. So it's going to be a pretty long journey here, so he's getting charged with, well, he's getting arrested now. Uh, we're going to place him under arrest for driving a boat uh, under the influence and driving without a boating license as well.
Plus being in this restricted area, so. He's gonna get a whole bunch of charges from us today, so let's go ahead and take him in. Really is nice being able to, um, being able to tow other boats. I doubt it would work, but I wonder if we could use police partner the driver mode to see if they would like drive the boat properly. Probably not though, because I don't think they know. Oh, where to drive when they're on water or in water. All right, we got a Attention while to go, guys, so Lincoln sit back, 18. relax, we have and a I'll, alert I'll and pick up once we're back in Toledo Bay. All right, guys, what a busy day. I can't believe we actually worked the full GTA shift. It's about 5 o'clock now. All right, so... We're coming back on the uh, Polito Bay station here. We're gonna go ahead and dock his shit up. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe I just said that. We're gonna go ahead and dock his ship up. Uh, ship. That's what I said, ship. Um, <laughs> so that was hilarious. Um, and then we'll, uh, we'll probably go ahead and we'll arrest him. We'll charge him with everything we're gonna charge him with. And we'll probably go ahead and call it an episode here, guys. So it looks like, don't know what I did there, but <laughs> looks like we have a little bit too many vehicles. Not sure what I did there while we were gone. Um, Alright, we'll uh, park up right over here. his in a little bit. I was hoping he'll swing around that way, but the current's taking him back out. Uh, partner, I'm gonna get his boat secured, so just keep an eye on him, and then I'll uh, come back and we'll we'll do what we gotta do with him. Oh shoot. <laughs> that was not supposed to happen. Alright. So let me go ahead and deal with his bullet now. I didn't mean to pull it so close in. Whoops. All units, citizens report suspicious activity in Palato Bay. Units respond code 2. Alright, so we'll park his up right over here. And uh, we'll get somebody to come pick his boat up. So I'll just park it here so if somebody could come just pick it up and put it on a trailer. We'll leave it facing him. Alrighty, so let's get back on our boat. I saw my partner got out. Did our suspect get out too? Let's see if our suspect's still inside. Yeah, he's still inside. Alright, so let's get our uh, suspect out here. Uh, I was hoping that wasn't going to happen. Alright, let's get our suspect right this way, sir. So he's going to be going to report suspicious activity in Palato Bay. Units respond code 2. Oh. This is Adam 
five. Copy that. We'll keep an eye out. All right, sir. So you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna be being placed under arrest today for driving under the influence of alcohol. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and give him his charges here. So we're gonna charge him with uh, no license. Uh, I'm guessing this slice registration. All right, he's gonna de definitely get that. Uh, I think that's all he's gonna get. And then I was looking for something that said like no license. I see we have expired license, but he doesn't have a boating license at all. So we're gonna give him this. And damn, two thousand dollars in fines. Ouch. So he's gonna go ahead and get those fines, plus he's getting arrested as well. Oh, we got a nice sunrise and now a nice sunset. Alright sir, so go ahead and place Sorry, your hands behind crap. your back, okay? Wish I probably did this before we put him in the boat, but all good. So let's get a unit to come pick him up. Backup needed for a suspect he's gonna be under arrest in transported. Palato Forest. Adam 6, copy! We'll check it out! Roger. Vespucci police, really? <laughs> I didn't even know I had that installed. Alright, so they're gonna go ahead and take him in. Got him there, buddy? They probably crashed because he can't drive in here. But anyway, guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy. I thank you guys so, so much for watching. Uh, he's, he's getting him in there now. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you guys hit that like button. If you guys would like to support the channel anyway, definitely check out the merchandise we have. AcePilot2K7.com slash shop. You can get t-shirts, hoodies, book bags, cups. And also if you want to become an Ace scribe and an Ace member and support the streams on a monthly basis, you could do that by becoming an Ace member. AcePilot2K7.com slash register slash exclusive. You go ahead and sign up as a member. You're able to watch some exclusive videos that are only on my website. You're able to be a part of some private live streams. Plus, you're able to um, play multiplayer games with me. So right now, I'm playing Fortnite. Uh, I'm probably going to do some GTA Online PC. And then we're also going to do American Truck Simulator, Players Unknown Battlegrounds, and maybe even Farming Simulator too. So if you want to play those multiplayer games with me, definitely... Check that out and become an a subscriber today. So anyway, guys, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions about Coastal Callouts, you can go ahead and leave them down below. Or you can go ahead and check out the work in progress page on LLCPDFR.com. Link is down below. And again, if you want to check it out for yourself, check out the parkmods.com slash donate. Again, link is all down below. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. Really do hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.